A woman, a woman five feet tall is walking at a speed of six feet per second away from a street light, which is mounted at a height of 20 feet. So you have a street light at a height of 20 feet. The woman is five feet tall. It's not drawn to scale. There is the distance she is away from the pole. And then there's the length of her shadow. These two together make up the distance to the tip of the shadow. And so we have to See here. There we go. <clears throat> okay. So um, yeah, it's just like the problem we had done uh, in class. Uh, how fast? Uh, call this distance s, the distance to the tip of the shadow. S is the distance to the tip of the shadow. And so we want to find uh, ds dt. How fast is the tip of her shadow moving? So they want us to ask the question, what is DSDT. And so S is made up of X and Y. It's our job to take the T derivative of this equation. And what we get is uh, DX DT plus DY DT. Both these guys have derivatives of 1. We know how fast she's walking away from the pole. This uh, 6 feet per second is dx dt. What we need is dy dt. We don't have that. But we do know that this is definitely a 6. But what dy dt is is a mystery to us right now. In most of these problems, what you're going to find is that uh, part of the information you have is explicitly given to you, the other part you have to go out and find. In order to find what uh, dy dt is, we need a relationship between x and y. And so that comes from similar triangles. Let me just draw crude copies of the triangle above. In this triangle, we have 20 and x plus y for the base. And in the smaller triangle, we have 5 and, um, and, and y for the base. And, and they are similar triangles. And so from similar triangles, uh, what we get is that their corresponding parts are in proportion and so um, there's many different ways to set it up. One way is to say that um, 20 is to x plus y if I were to stay inside of one triangle as 5 is to y and this will give us our relationship between x and y that we need. This says 20y is 5x plus 5y. So, subtract it over, 
15y is 5x or that y is one-third of x. It was regardless of how far she's, um, she is from the light, this 10 has nothing to do with the problem. If y is a third of x, then what you can do is take the derivative and say that dy dt is a third of dx dt. And we know dx dt is 2, 6, uh, 6, sorry. dx dt is 6, so dy dt is 2. And so now that we know dy dt, we can say what ds dt is. Just the sum of these. And so we get 8. The units are in feet per second. And that is the answer to this uh, second question.